Hello you guys, I'm back again because I have another new toy to show you. But before we get into it, let me give a quick disclaimer by saying that I was not paid for this review, all opinions are my own, and I was sent this toy for free. The toy we've got here today is called Love Kill by Layuto, and I'll put that below so that you guys can see it. I really do love the box. The design on it is so cool. It does have a little storage pouch, very soft and nice gray. Here is the toy. You will probably notice that I have several other toys like this in my collection. I am a big fan of precise clitoral stimulation. It comes with a magnetic charger and it comes with three interchangeable tips, which I love because it totally changes the experience. It does have different patterns, increasing in intensity and decreasing in intensity in certain wavelengths, which is fun. Actually, I kind of enjoy that. It's kind of a fun game. You can play with yourself to see if you can orgasm on a certain wavelength and it is dual ended so this end is insertable and it vibrates as well according to the pamphlet i just pulled out and read the name of the toy is actually candy and it does have a flapping g-spot insertable wand part so that would be this oh whoa this little spot right here is actually soft on both sides and you can feel that there's like a knocking or some sort of rocking mechanism in there so that when you do insert it it is hitting your G spot you can change the speed there are two buttons on the handle here one for vibration and one to control the flapping when you hold down and you press the top button that will turn on the clitoral stimulation tip and it is pretty strong even on the lowest setting oh wow it's intense each time you press it it will go up in speed and then eventually it will also change patterns you can hold down on that long press to sh turn it off and then if you hold down on the bottom button it will activate the g-spot flapping this top part is buzzing like crazy and then you should be able to press on that button a couple more times and it will increase the intensity of this G-spot portion. If you keep clicking that button, it will also change the pattern of the G-spot portion. There you can see the movement a little bit better. I haven't tried this toy out yet. I just opened it today, but I can tell from how it feels on my hand and the motion that I can see that this is going to be a really good feeling toy. One thing I really like about this toy in comparison to the other I have that is similar is this G-spot knocking portion is really quite soft. The other one is hard and if you don't get it in the right position, sometimes that motion on your G-spot can just be a little too aggressive. This one I think will feel a bit more comfortable. Here on the back, these two little silver dots is where you are going to connect your magnetic charger that came with your toy and there should be a click like that let's have a look at the different attachments that came with it the attachments are really quite simple to put on because they just have a little indent and you slip them right over the top like a little hat and this one is going to be a very fun little hat you see all of the little spikes on that tip they are very soft and wiggly that is going to feel very tingly. I really like this tip. Another tip for this toy is the little bunny ears. It goes right on top just like the other one and then you can position these little ears around your labia and get a totally different sensation than you would with the first tip. The last tip is just a slightly larger ball head with some texture on it like little lines, kind of like a pumpkin. This type of tip is really good if you feel like you need a little bit more surface coverage. 
It is waterproof. It takes 120 minutes to charge and it can run for up to 60 minutes without needing to be recharged. It is also made of silicone. I looked up the price on their Amazon store and it's only $25.99, which makes it a fairly affordable toy. That's gonna do it for today, guys. If you like this toy and you wanna order one for yourself, I will put the link to where you can find it in the description below. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.